the Opopka Studios in Oklahoma City. This is an OSU update with John Helsley. I'm Jenny Carlson. John, a bedlam, big bedlam, a big bedlam win for Oklahoma State on Saturday. Uh, we found out, though, in the uh, post game, in the aftermath of this thing, that Bedlam 2 was impacted by Bedlam 1. Talk about that. Yeah, we had actually even heard back when they lost that first Bedlam game that there were some early morning practices that took place. Now we know 6 a.m. practices, which wouldn't be very appealing to a college kid, but uh, two a days even. And, you know, Travis Ford said he just saw something in his team that day in Norman that he didn't like. Wasn't necessarily anything he'd seen before, but he wanted to kind of nip it in the bud. And they really addressed some things that uh, in that week after that. And uh, they feel like it's really been a big factor in, in this seven-game winning streak. When you think back about that overtime victory uh, in Bedlam 2, uh, what sort of stands out to you? I mean, obviously Marcus Smart is Marcus Smart, and he's fantastic. But are there some things that as you reflect back on that win and just how important it was for this team that stands out to you? you know, pretty much just the toughness that this team showed in the second half and in the overtime. Let's remember, OU shot 61% from the floor. You know, that's a lot to overcome. They were playing well on the road. Sam Grooms was really playing well against them. They really didn't seem to have an answer for him, but they kind of willed their, willed their way, you know, and found a way to win, find a way to get it into overtime and then win it. You mentioned Marcus Smart. He's always a constant in this thing. But this is a team that in a lot of these games during the streak, has really shown a late game toughness. Now things get obviously easier with Kansas coming to Gallagher Iba. I joke, of course. This this is a huge game. It might determine the Big Twelve title, regular season title. This week, I mean, this is obviously going to be a huge game for the Cowboys. It is, and when you say might determine the title, it's going to be a, a heavy influence for the Cowboys, especially. This is one of the teams they're tied with. They still have Kansas State later to come into their place. So if they can find a way to win this game Wednesday, uh, and, and know this, Kansas will come in highly motivated. If they can find a way to win this game, you would think they'd be in the driver's seat knowing that they have Kansas State coming to their place really to end the regular season. Should be a great time later on down the road. At West Virginia, at TCU to follow. Easier test, obviously. Easier test. You know, anytime you go to West Virginia, it's, it's going to be one of the longer flights you take. It's a new place. They're probably a little bit better than, than they've shown this year, but still a game you should win. All right. Thanks, John. Be sure to stay with the best coverage team anywhere at newsok.com and every day in the Oklahoman.